So today um, on our, my website, I've just uh, put out a new announcement on how to make a Google Slides auto update. And um, when you click the, and open the document um, on the website, you come here to these directions. So the first thing to do is to make a copy of that spreadsheet there. And I have that set up so you can just simply make a copy. You would then be the owner of it. And all this spreadsheet has in it is today's date, and then a function called today. And I've formatted it like that. It could be formatted any way you would like. The next step then is to um, go to file. While you're here, you can go to it right from your file and make a new presentation. And so here's my new presentation. I'll just call this auto update. Or actually it's called auto date. So this is just an example, and you could add this to any of your um, uh, slides that you would like to. So I'm going to just get rid of those two functions. I just simply come back to the web, to my sheet, and I select those two cells, and I copy them, come to my new slide, and I paste, and it should ask me if I want to link to the spreadsheet. So I simply say yes. Now notice with that link there, I'm linked to this sheet. So when the data on the sheet changes. So for instance, if I come here and um, somehow misspell, oh, uh, wrong field, command Z. Uh, if I was in this field and, and just changed that. So I've changed the data here. Notice when I come here, this tells me to update. And so now when I update that, it says today's dated. I'm gonna come back and get rid of that. I was just showing you how those are linked. So the function uh, um, on the sheet, again, an update, so today's date. So whenever the data changes on the, on the sheet, the, uh, it will update, you'll have the update button on your slide. Um, so you'll see the little update button. And basically now if I developed a slide, um, when I come in to use it in the morning, this is going to have an update button and I would have that automatically uh, update for me. So while we're at it, I'm also wanting to show you another function that we can do, and this puts an, a date into a um, uh, this puts a date into the Google Doc that you might be working with. So the way we do this, well, I'm going to quickly uh, come in here and take a look at this other document I've got created. So there's a simple script that we've written that lets me take this. Um, at the point of the cursor, I have a new menu now called Utilities Insert Date, and then I've told it to format it uh, bold and italic. So this lets me insert the correct date into my document at the point of the cursor. That's done with a script, and the script looks like this. Um, it's a pretty simple script. I'm going to copy this script for you. Copy. And I'm going to actually come back over to uh, my document here. And I'm going to um, get my cursor up here. And I want to paste in that whole script for you. I'll clean that up. But that is going to um, show how you could take a script, add it to your Google Doc. So, so basically, if I did this on, on this Google Doc, for instance, I would come here to Tools, go to Script Editor, Go ahead and simply paste in, uh, first of all, highlight and delete the code that's in there. Paste in all this new code that should be set up correctly. Give my uh, title, uh, uh, my project a title, so this is auto date. And I'm going to say OK to that. Go ahead and save it. And that should all be functioning correctly. Now when I come back to this document, I would actually have to reload the document, so I will refresh. And when it refreshes the document, you'll notice a few seconds we come in with this utilities and my insert date. So if I wanted today's date um, right there, I would now just simply insert date. Now the very first time you run a script, you have to authorize it. And I would simply do that really quickly, allow this project to run on my sheet, and there's my date auto input. Now that's going to be on, on this particular document. So um, anytime you make a copy of this document, uh, I could install this on my template 
and then I would actually uh, that that creates all of these documents, and then as soon as I uh, I could automatically uh, put in today's date, although my documents are automatically dated because they're created with uh, with uh, Document Studio. So again, what we're looking at is how you can take a sheet, make a very simple sheet. You you should be able to use this today sheet anywhere you would want uh, today's date. So out of interest. What happens when I copy the data, come back over here, uh, find my uh, a place I want to paste that table in, paste that, link to the spreadsheet, and there's today's date. So I could also paste this spreadsheet into a Google Doc as well as a Google Slide and have today's date uh, formatted however I want it to look show up on all my documents.